Hello, become music possibility team. This is an experiment that I have for you for this week. And it's called speaking in tongues. But because we're in music space, it's going to be called singing in tongues. So, you know, you probably know what this is, speaking in tongues. This is your own tongue. When you hear somebody saying speaking in tongues, it's like they're speaking a language that cannot be understood or it's like their own tongue. It's like a language where only you know what you're saying, but nobody else knows what you're saying. And the what I discovered from experimenting with this is that it creates, in a way, a bridge to something else that is a bit unknown, that only you know about. Is in a way, going into your uh, potential, the potential of what are the sounds when there is no that uh, layer of logic that is carried with the language, but that the feelings can flow, the expression can flow, and even intent can be used in in the expression. And we're gonna go into this experiment again. It's gonna be about uh, three minutes of, of expressing of singing from uh, singing in tongues, and. The setup for this, you, you set this up for, for, in a way, going into a place of unknown where, where you don't know what's going to come out. And the first the first part is connecting with your feelings and, and being starting from first position, connecting with your center, connecting with your grounding core, and connecting with your bubble of space, declaring your grounding core and your bubble of space, making sure that you're centered and allowing yourself to, to feel. And this is the, the beginning point of this, um, uh, of this experiment. So the, the purpose of the experiment and of speaking and singing in tongues is that it can create a bridge into other possibilities that are not aware for you because you are so stuck in the way that you speak, the, the way that you're normally, you know yourself that you speak. And, and in creating this bridge of singing from singing uh, in tongues, you create this strange thing that it's uh, something else beyond what you are familiar with. And where I was stuck in before I've been doing this experiment for the last 10 years or so and is that I I didn't realize the impact of it I didn't realize how powerful it was and for for me it was only a, a first it was kind of a joke or something funny and then it became this thing that was really empowering in the for in the in the sense of expressing myself and and now like after practicing for for some more time it's like this is really a bridge. This has really created, it has changed my music. It has changed the, the possibilities that I that I get when I'm in, in the music space. And what I've been striving to do is uh, like going to speaking in tongues and at the same time, staying in contact with meaning. This is the important part for me, like staying in contact with meaning that you're staying in, in, in your feelings, that you're expressing the feelings and that you're staying in contact with intention and meaning. And, and this is the, the experiment. It's like a constant experiment of, of finding that going into expressing nonsense and whatever comes up and allowing that nonsense to have some sort of meaning that you don't go into just expressing for the heck of it, but to have a, a meaning. So I'm gonna do this for three minutes as a, a experiment. I'm putting the timer, put the timer, three minutes, and then you end the, the experiment. So uh, at the bottom, at the bottom of this experiment is feeling. So make sure that, that you are feeling the, what you're uh, what you're doing. On the, on the other side is the expression that you express in that feeling, that there is an expression of that feeling. 
And on the other side is the intent or the meaning, what you're meaning to do. So, one moment. Okay, I hope you can hear me okay here. I went outside uh, because the little birds inside, they were asking for space. And uh, I came out here to the experiment out here. So you set the timer for three minutes and you let yourself go into a space of unknown. So here we go. Three, two, one. Is yourself in? No, so much and Then you let the sensations land in your body. I think I went over 30 seconds. I didn't hear the alarm. 
and just let that experience be be there with you. That there was some different voices, different things that were expressed in a different way, and allow these things to also be you, also be part of you. It's not like one voice is you and one voice is not you. There is a voice that that is familiar to you and that you are most attached to, and there is the whole range of what your voice is capable of. And if you if you only stay in this little part of yourself, it, it you don't give your voice a chance to to explore all these different ranges of different things that it can communicate. So the purpose of this experiment is to go really to that place where you don't even know you can talk and you can still communicate something. You can still say something and have your voice be an instrument of power and in this way you allow yourself to to play with it and find different ranges of your voice that you can make and this is a scary experiment when we are so attached to our familiar voice and what we are used to so go ahead and experiment and sing in tongues and if you do this let me know how it goes and share share your findings your discovery share your recording how did it go and we do this uh, every every week in our possibility team so if you want a team about this and if you want to have a, a team space to explore this get different possibilities get feedback from your team and it, this is a space where we meet there every week on tuesdays from 10 30 to 12 pacific time so I hope to see you there. Let me know if you want to join. I'll send you the details. And this is it for now. And until the next time.